All right, surprise trip. We are in Miami. Obviously, uh, I'm here for business, but let's be real, it's, it's fishy business. And uh, we got the poles, we got bait bag with all our stuff that we're gonna try throwing out and everything. Got the St. Croix, hopefully put it to good use. Travel rod. Oh man, I'm so excited. I'm gonna start off on the pier right now. I'm gonna use the trolley method. I'll show you guys what that looks like pretty soon. But man, I'm beside myself. Oh, it's like Disneyland out here for fishermen. All right, quick look at the goods. This is how we're gonna be walking around. Poles and a live bait bucket. Oh man, I love using live bait in um, Florida. Hopefully they're as easy to catch as they were a year ago. Let's go find out. Good morning, fellas. We just got out here to uh, beautiful Miami Sunny Isles. We're at Newport Pier, which uh, I think due to the new world that we live in, is closed until seven. We can walk on the gate, I could probably hop, but it's not worth it. I wanna fish here a whole day. I don't wanna get kicked out or anything. I was thinking of fishing here a little bit, but again, I can't fish here. I don't want no problems. We'll see, but uh, hopefully it's going to be a very exciting day. Uh, I'm very hopeful. I'm going to get that, that that morning bite, that sunrise, beautiful Florida sunrise. See what we can get up. I heard there were bonitos uh, pulled up here just yesterday. Uh, obviously a little bit of mackerel. I've been told there's some snook around here. Hopefully someone catches one. Hopefully I catch one. We'll see. Jack, I think... Oh, no, no. <sighs> Nice jack. Oh shit. Nice jack. Oh yeah guys. <laughs> we were just live lining. Look, those are all snook all around there. My buddy's gonna try to help me out here. Yo, someone throw a throw a live for a snook. The snook are right here. They're, I'm keeping them right here. They're they're excited by this. <laughs> All right, we got it, guys. We got it. What is it, Jack? Mm -hmm. yeah. You want it? Yeah. It's yours. Okay, thank you. Woo. Nice. <laughs> we did it. Oh, man. I just, uh, you, you, get, you help me with a picture, yeah? Oh, buddy. Am I glad to see you. Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Been you sitting there all Diego? day. I thought it was a snook. I, I'd rather oh, a snook, but whatever. <laughs> that car was in the game. That Jack, Jack Craval, right? Uh, that's nice. Oh, yeah. You take a picture for me, bud? Uh, take a picture for me? Yeah. All right. Let's see what's going on here. What's the first one? Uh, of this size, yeah. I never got one this size. I got smaller. You got one, Dada. You can't get it in. <sighs> Yeah, buddy. Guys, you guys can't fish here. Oh, yeah, I just, this guy just jumped up on the pier. You know, you try to be in the place to go fishing. What are you talking about? All right, man. <laughs> Where? No, I'm from New York. Oh, damn, you way from home. No, but this guy right here taught me how to fish. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm from, At least in Florida. I'm from Kentucky. Oh, nice. Yeah, dude, I gotta get me another. I bet. I gotta get me another. Oh, I thought it was a snook. I know, I know. 
Oh, they're caught right up there. Oh, dude, right. the, 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 the amount of beautiful fish caught against the rules, I can't even tell you. <laughs> John over here. There he is. No! Oh! oh man, it just popped off and he had him. He had him! I got another one. I don't know. I might get another one. Board, guys, another jack. Just, if you don't got anything to do with it, uh, I can use it for shark bait. Uh, he's, uh, I gave it to Pierre. Watch out, he has teeth. No, I'm gonna give it to Pierre. He, he showed me a lot yeah, of stuff. He'll eat that thing. Yeah. He got my little fish. <laughs> nice fish, man. Yeah. What what? It? It's a Jack Craval. Jack Craval. Jack Craval. Yeah, yeah. Uh, my friend who's coming, he's gonna eat it. Yeah. Yeah, I got this one. There seems to have started a commotion over here. They're taking my lure out of it right now. That's Pierre, by the way. He taught me how to fish here using the trolley method. All right. Big nice. I'll take a a measurement. And here he is. Yes, yeah, for you. I just want to hold it. You want a picture? Huh? Oh yeah, picture, picture. Of course, I do a picture. Oh, that's a bigger one. Okay. Yes. All right. You want to check it out? It's still alive, so don't go near its mouth. But you can touch it, like on the top. <laughs> hey, you want to touch it? <laughs> Until here? Yeah. The top. No, I'm from over here to over here. Watch. Over here. Yeah. Okay. 27. 27. 27. 27. 28. Nice, nice. I just want to know from my records. <laughs> now we fight. It's like a, a race. <laughs> go, go, go. <laughs> Man. Ain't no people swimming here. Come on. Yes. Come on. Ah. Oh, they say no. Oh. Yo, can you help me out here? Put that on my shoulder? Yeah, thanks man.
Comment ça dit Squid. Squid. No squid. No squid. No squid. Nice small one. Like this. Yeah, blue runner. Yeah, blue one. The blue eye, that's good. Oh, yeah, small. Shrimp. Oh, shrimp. Shrimp. Okay. How do you say? Shrimp. 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 You need more, you can. No, no, that's not what that is. It's okay. I got some. Thank you. Yep.
snook. I'm just saying that there's snook under this chair. Yeah, there's snook. What are you fishing with? A uh, live blue runner. I just have him live lined over there. Just hanging out. See this guy? Snook ah. guys, we got a snook over here. All right, fight it a bit. Keep fighting it. Watch out, guys! Watch out! Watch out, guys! Guys, guys! Watch out! Watch out! Watch out, guys! Where's the net? Nobody's got a net, so we're gonna have to. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna go to the beach. All right, guys, I'm gonna run to the beach, see if I can help him get it. We're running. We're gonna get this guy. He, he's not getting away. We got a snook coming. We got a snook coming. Oh yes! <laughs> oh, we, we can't go past this line, so. I got him! Alright, hold on. Let me... Okay, you can talk. <laughs> we got it! <laughs> Snook. Yeah. Here we go guys. Snook. On the beach. Oh. <laughs> We got him, guys. Look at this guy. Woo! That's not bad. Congratulations! <laughs> you got a snook. Oh, man. Oh, by the way. Yeah, it could be. Wow. You gave the dedication. You got there for hours. You got it. <laughs> yeah. You did it, man. I hope my rods are still there. My first snook. Yo. That's what's up. Now I gotta get one. <laughs> what were you using? Blue runner? There was three under the dog. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. I told, I told you that's what was gonna happen. We prepped for it like two minutes before. 
Oh, we made it past the yellow line. Oh, man. That was so much fun. Nếu mà không có cái kéo cắt á, trong cái sân vang 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 là còn kéo đấy rồi. Hey, David. David. Okay. Or New York, that's cool. Because I'm from New York. <laughs> nah, it's fine. Double hook up here, guys. On these uh, amber jacks, I think. Ooh, and a little bit of a tangle. And through movie magic, we are back in New York, guys. Uh, that was an awesome trip. I had a lot of success. I had that barracuda. I did not manage to get up a snook, but I saw I witnessed a lot of snook. I was able to get that one at the beach, which was quite the experience, a lot of fun. Jack Cravals, uh, got some small snappers off camera. Um, but you know, one of the biggest takeaways, you know, especially I had a lot of success and it was all at that same pier, Newport Pier. And uh, one of the takeaways is the locals. You gotta get friendly with the locals. You know, some of them have a, a thorny skin, but you know, you just keep going. They see you there, they see you dedicated, they see, you know, you're there for hours on end. They'll, they'll start to warm up to you and they really, they teach you stuff. Just to give you an example, that barracuda that you guys just saw, I caught that using a local's bait. I made a deal with them. I said, listen, you give me one of your mahara, I'll give you whatever fish I catch, you know, and like, because I knew him already from last year and this and that, went, went ahead with it. Uh, also Pierre, I, uh, I didn't have a spot where to put my pole one day and he's like, hey, just put it between my two poles, no problem. You know, usually he would never allow that because we have a rapport, you know, we're, we're friendly. He, uh, he let me put the pole right there and I caught fish, you know? So it's, it's really, knowing the locals is a big thing. Try to be friendly out there. You know, it also helps when you get tangled with them, they don't get as mad at you, or if they tangle with you, you don't really get mad at them. And yeah, you know, just new spots, you gotta check with the locals. You could know every single technique there is to catch a fish, but the locals, they usually know better because they're there every day. They're the usuals. And yeah, so without them, I don't know where I would be in Florida in terms of catching fish. Definitely catching something, but not, you know, last year was a king mackerel and Spanish mackerel and this and that, which I'll, I'll show you right now. But uh, yeah, that's uh, that's Florida for you. There are monsters out there. New York is fun. We got the striped bass. We got the bluefish. But man, Florida's another animal. Until next time, guys, stay groovy. Yeah.